keep yourself prepared for the unexpected and have confidence in yourself and your team. Mm -hmm. Cause that can be In about high school, I kind of got into advertising and I figured I wanted to do that, uh, writing advertisements, designing ads. So I actually went to college for that. However, as I went through college and kind of learned about advertising, I realized that there was a lot of it that just wasn't for me, mostly the business aspect of it. I was more interested in the creative side. So that was kind of when I finally decided that, all right, I'm going to go into maybe TV or movie production where I can just focus primarily on the creation side of it. Once I graduated college, my first job uh, on set was for a straight-to-DVD comedy western starring the Insane Clown Posse. And that was pretty much my first time on set. I had a chance to see all the jobs and all the people that uh, worked on the set of the movie. Because prior to that, I had never really learned much about movie production. I had to go to film school. But through this, I was able to, one, be resourceful. I was able to see what I could do. And at the time, I figured, if you want to work in production, this is how you do it. You have to be freelance and you have to be broke for years. There's no such thing as a salary production job. At least that's what I thought at the time. When I first started Supertrade, I wasn't an editor or a shooter. I was more in the uh, kind of production coronation role. And then eventually I kind of moved into editing. Even before I had jobs in editing, I was practicing on my own time. So when the editing opportunity came up at Supercharged, I was like, well, I could do it because it's something that I've been practicing for years and a long time anyways. Supercharged not only kind of changed my opinion or changed my outlook on being able to be involved in production and still have a salary job, but also changed how I saw the passion that people had in the industry. Because before this, I thought you only have passion if you're a freelancer. If you work salary, you become a cubicle worker and you just kind of become a zombie. And Supercharged proved all that wrong because I've worked with so many passionate people at this company, embrace the random. And when I say that, I don't mean that in a passive way, more in a proactive preparation way, because I don't think anything in life and definitely nothing at Supercharge happens randomly. Everything typically has some, something leading up to it. But the random refers more to what you have to do for yourself to prepare and also uh, keep yourself prepared for the unexpected and have confidence in yourself and your team that if something does happen, if shit does go south, you guys can handle it. And it's also about embracing and even appreciating when unpredictable things happen because, I mean, those are surprises. And those things aren't just that to keep you on your toes, but it keeps things interesting because how boring would life be if everything always went according to plan? Because that can be a boost, boost.